welcome to my channel if you're new here hi my name is jackie um and this is my first video of november next week is thanksgiving guys yeah it's going by so freaking fast and everything i'm about to show you guys i swear i have been buying for the past two months and i just been accumulating it in a corner in my dining room and i was like i think it's time to make a video because guys i have target i have more shoes home goods at home five below um at the party i have so much and if you don't follow me on ig i do do little stories here and there when i find certain things so if you follow me on ig you seen some of these items already but if you haven't just have a cup of coffee water anything you would like and grab a seat because it might be pretty long um, i decided I'm to sit in front of my fireplace no it's not decorated i just try to throw something real quick and these two guys i'm gonna show you in a little bit but i figured let me sit on the floor surround myself for all this decor because i think it's a little too much so i'm gonna try, like i said i'm gonna try to break it down to three parts if not maybe two just because guys like i said one more week before thanksgiving i do put my christmas tree on thanksgiving day um just because i wanted to feel like i don't know like the christmas spirit on thanksgiving but anyway um i felt a little festive and i threw the shirt on guys i found a five below but we'll get right to it and um yeah guys let's get right to this because it's um, a lot i'm sipping on water because i feel like i'm gonna do a lot of talking and has anybody picked up the stanley all right so well, let's get right to it and also i just want to clarify i know i do a lot of talking with my hands but it's just a habit i have always been like that i am spanish i am puerto rican but i was born in the united states my family's from puerto rico but anyway um and we always talk with our hands i don't know i'm sorry it it just it's just a thing <laughs> but anyway all right let's get right to it so we're gonna start with uh actually um at home i picked up like three items and everything is just like thrown in bags so if i don't go by order it's just because i must have threw something in another bag that was from a certain store but anyway the first item is uh, this mini gingerbread house guys this is i feel like the theme for christmas this year is gingerbread houses everywhere instagram facebook any social media you go to gingerbread houses so i picked up this little one because i don't want to do a whole gingerbread thing thing even though it's so beautiful but i'm trying to use everything i have from last year which I was, I was going through my bins. It was not long. So, yeah. So, I wanted to incorporate this little guy. It's so beautiful. And it also lights up. Let me see. Oh, it needs batteries. Um, It also lights up. I have one, but it's all brown from Michael's from last year. The same size. And I didn't even notice till I was going through my Christmas decor. And I found it. I was like, oh, now I have, like, the pastel one and the regular gingerbread one. So, yeah. So, this is one of the, like, famous items people because people are really going crazy for all this gingerbread stuff here's another gingerbread house i think this one already has batteries does it yes and it is so pretty and um, i got it because guys i am so proud of myself i finished my coffee bar and i always leave that for last that's the only thing i have literally done for christmas like decor my coffee bar but i'm just waiting for like one or two pieces because i also been placing online orders and i have some coming so but anyway but yes i'm incorporating this little guy in my um coffee bar as well and it is so pretty it's not so big and you know it's just the right size to add to my coffee bar so um both things are from at home then i got this a little tree um it also lights up and i just love the new shoes with the gold it's my vibe if you don't know by now my thing is neutral colors even though i love the traditional christmas but i've had done that i have done rose gold blue pink i've done so many and now i'm just like okay 
is just stick with the neutrals. I am trying to incorporate some greens, but as of right now, I haven't bought any like ornaments for my Christmas tree because I can't find that green I want. I want like a dark green, like the shirt, and I just can't find it. And also like the ribbon, I want that velour um green, and I can't find it as well. Wow. Okay, item I pre-ordered a couple of months ago. I want to say maybe like the summertime last, or maybe like it was like around the summertime January. I can't remember. And I finally got it in um a couple of months ago it's this huge which i didn't read the description i have a habit of doing that um not reading the description and once i receive the item i'm like oh that is pretty big <laughs> so this is the joanna parker joanna joanna yeah joanna parker cookie canister but it is humongous but i just i just love it so and guys some of the prices i don't i don't even know it's just been so long some has the tags on them so but yeah this cutie i'm glad i picked him up though even though he's humongous um let me just put him right here the other item i it's from a um, mud pie it's this cute reindeer mug and i just like love it it's so pretty yeah it's from mud pie I placed it online on order, so I'm not sure, but I want to say maybe like $10, $15. I can't remember, guys. But if you go on the website, I could try to link it, but I'm not sure if they are still online because a lot of the things I purchased, I know it's like sold out or you can't. It's not online. But yeah, I got this cute reindeer mug. The other mud pie mug. And guys, once again, by now, for the people who've been following me from day one, thank you, first of all. And you know by now, I am addicted to mugs. I collect mugs and candles. I collect a lot of things. But those are the two things that I collect the most of. So this is another mug, the Santa mug. I did purchase this on... What was it? couple like all this stuff i have purchased through the summertime like and i've just been putting away as well so this is another mug that i have been that i have worn so i got that one the other one is this one it says mary and it has all these little trees and once again it's neutral and, and it's from the mud pie and it came with like a little green ribbon but i took it out because i have been using it but it is so pretty so that's another one. world market i did place an order online and a lot of it got canceled which really pissed me off because at the time it was available but i guess their process takes forever and by the time they processed my order a lot of it wasn't um available but i did pick up our order this other neutral once again mug christmas mug and it has the christmas tree and i thought it was so pretty and it's also 7.99 so guys if you're in a town where they have this store go pick it up or go check your um world market unfortunately i'm in new york they don't have these type of stores out here but i'm glad that they do have it online that you could purchase from so this is how it looks all right um another it's not Christmassy, but I did pick these up as well. This one's $5.99. Actually, they both $5.99. And I thought it was so pretty to add candlesticks to them. So I picked up so these. For five below. I got this t-shirt. Well, I guess you could I'm trying to see. This t-shirt. And it's so cute. It got Santa on it. I also got this. Trying to pull it up. Gingerbread mat, also five dollars. And this is another like, it's a dupe for the Kirkland order and on Amazon. And I'm trying to see. I don't know how many orders I placed, but it's somewhere around here. <laughs> um, I placed an order for this little picture with a deer, which is so pretty. And I want to say it was $16 or $17. It doesn't say the price. It just says stoneware picture, which I think is so cute. I'm going to use it in my kitchen and add my wooden spoons on it. So I got that. 
I also picked up this little like vintage Santa. And I want to say it was, I want to say 20. I can't remember guys. I'm sorry. But, but I have it in my Amazon account. So I could just like link these two items if you're interested. But yeah, he is so cute. He has glitter. I'm actually going to add him inside. A, a, well, I'm going to put a dome over him because he fits perfectly. on This mug right here is from Big Lots, which I placed an order for them. That's what I'm waiting for. Um, they have canceled my order three times, guys. How? It's for um, a sign, like a gold, what did it say? Fresh farm, and it has trees. It's very pretty. And I already know where I want to put it. So I have placed that order three times already, and they have canceled. But all those three times, you know, like, guys, when I go online, it's available. So when I call customer service, they said it. It could show it's available, but maybe they haven't gotten around to say unavailable. Guys, that, that doesn't make any sense to me. But anyway, I got this mug and he was $5.99. I did place the order with him for store pickup with the sign. So I got a 15% off or something like that. But when I went to the store, they didn't have it. They said they might have it in the back, but they so backed up with so much Christmas decor and boxes that it may be somewhere out there. But for now, they had to cancel my order. Then I I canceled it. I mean, I ordered it one more time. So fingers crossed this time ships. Right now, it's the same process for the past week. All right. So let's just do. I'm just right now at the moment. I'm just going to do random stores because everything is just like around me. But let me just show you guys this one real quick because this one was online. In that little boutique. Um, This girl, I this lady I follow on Instagram posted and she um, posted the link and girl I jumped on it real quick because it's so pretty and girl if you watch my videos thank you um she posted the link to this pretty gingerbread um tree it was I think 40 I, I can't remember but that's how it looks and it's so pretty I have to fix the inside because I had to take that rubber piece out because it wasn't closing properly. So I was trying to figure out how to close it. But anyway, this is how it looks. And I could also link it here, but they sold out. I had a lot of ladies DM me asking um, for the link, but it sold out. So, but I will link it anyway. Maybe you could add yourself to like the waiting list so this um this mug is from home goods and i have posted this once again like on my instagram so pretty anthropology vibes guys i'm so mad i should have picked up two of them because i can't find them anymore like they were immediately gone and it was 9.99 but it's so pretty i love the gold like the rustic look to it like that um antique look to it so i I'm glad I got this. I think I'm just going to add spoons, like sugar spoons, which I ordered some from Amazon, some gold one, and they were so tiny. So I returned them. So if you know uh, any store that have like gold spoons, I just want the spoons, little spoons, big spoon for sugar. Please let me know down below in the comments because I checked Amazon. Fortunately, they, I got baby spoons. <laughs> so... I got that. I also got this mug, which is so cute. $5.99, a Santa mug. That's how he looks. All right. So, I picked up these napkins. They are recyclable four-piece napkins. And I just love how they look. And the reason I picked these up is I was going to pick up a towel because I want to hang it on my fire, um my coffee bar but they're so long so I was like well I could try to use a napkin to hang it and I wanted to buy a stamp like a Christmas stamp to stamp all over I'm not sure or just one side for it to say Merry Christmas and hang it and um these were $7.99 instead of four and I can't find a damn Santa stamp that I like <laughs> I did find these two stamps in Target. This one says Merry Christmas. Have yourself a Merry Little Christmas. And then these Christmas trees. 
so I'm trying to DIY or I'm trying to see how it will look. And I'm glad it's a set of four just in case I mess one up. <laughs> um, I, I think I want to like add like the um, trees like all over. Not too many, but lightly um, to give it like a nice like stamp effect or this Merry Little Christmas. I'm not sure which one. But I just want the, to get a stamp, like a vintage stamp. So like something like my shirt oh, would have been so perfect. But I even went on Etsy. I can't find. Well, I actually found, no lie. I found one, guys, online. But she wanted $23 for a stamp. Now, guys, I ain't trying to knock nobody's hustle. But $23 for a mini stick of this um bowl. It was $9.99. And I thought it would look cute to add ornaments. I did do that last year. I had a smaller bowl, but all the ornaments didn't fit as I wanted them to do. Um, to fit. I did purchase a garland. Um, and I think I'm gonna remove all the ornaments from them and throw them in here. So let's see how that will turn out. Let me just add this. I also got the Santa, but it, it looks like a puppet. But I had picked him up because I feel like he's new this year. Because I have the one from like two years ago, the skinny version one. And I thought they would look cute. Just like add them to something. So yeah, this he was $10. Which, guys, I, the prices have went up so much. I remember paying, I think it was like $7.99 for the skinnier Santa. But I mean, the economy is just not what it used to be. Oh. And let me just show you this little... Santa once again I bought him on Instagram on a little um what is she, like a a company is it I, I'm gonna try to tag it um and it's so cute look at him and it's funny because um a friend of mine tags me on it on Instagram like she put on story and I was like girl been bought it <laughs> been received it <laughs> so I'm glad that like some of the I call them friends because I don't like the word followers because I don't know my friend um i'm glad that they kind of know me and they know my vibe and what i like and they real quick to like dm me girl i thought i seen this and i thought of you and that makes me feel good <laughs> but yeah um this is the santa he's so cute all right so let's see all right this mug it was from it's from it's a mud pie mug guys it was from home goods and it wasn't like this i diy'd it i painted the Santa to make him look neutral. He was actually red and green. And as you can see, not anymore. I made him look like a neutral <laughs> Santa. Now definitely goes with my theme. But yeah, guys, if you have picked up this mug and you like this idea, go for it. Let me know down below if you do it. And if you have an Instagram, leave it down below as well because I would love to see how you did yours. But yeah, guys, this is how he could. He looks all right the next thing is this candle i already lit it because it's it smells good it kind of remind me i don't know um a little bit like baby oil and like christmas tree i don't know it's hard to describe i i, I suck at describing <laughs> um i just love how it has like santa and it looks so vintagey i noticed um a couple lady as well on Instagram picked them up. They actually tagged me, but it was like the smaller one. But they had the smaller one is a different scent. This one is um, it has one, two, three, four, five different scents to it. But it smells amazing. And this one was twelve ninety ninety nine. I think the smaller one was seven ninety nine. But yeah, I picked up this bad boy. And I, I think I want to go back to see if they have another one. Because if I light it, it's going to waste. And I just want to back up. I love candles. <laughs> so, all right, guys. Um, Let's see. Oh, Michaels. Let's see. So, guys, we're already 14 minutes going in. And I have so much. Um, I picked up this little soldier. Yes, from Michael's for nine fourteen ninety nine, but it was forty percent off, and he's just like brownish, like neutral. He is so cute. Um, once again, I'm gonna try to link 
as much things I could find in um, my description. So I got that in my room. So this, another item, I it was from Home Goods. It's from the Martha Stewart collection. And I just, I think I want to um, paint it brown. Like whitewash it. Not white because it's not white. But like a brown. Just because I already have a color like this. And I thought this would look nice to decorate, you know, um, what if you're going for like a vintage theme that's what i'm kind of going for and i also picked up this ribbon it was 5.99 as well and you could actually like decorate with these because that's what i'm getting to with it i really don't want to use the ribbon because i don't want to mess this up so i'm going to just use it as decor and this is another one i picked up this one was at marshall's for let's see $5.99 and it's so pretty once again like the only give you like that vintage vibes to it so once again just for decoration purposes <laughs> all right um let's see all right so these other items is walmart randomly it's just in a bag like i said i was just throwing stuff in bags and accumulating it in a corner in my dining room so i picked up if it's a scent um, and i I think I might go back to get more for my tree because I wasn't going to use it for my tree. I was just like going to use it as like a decor piece or something. But I might just add him to like my Christmas tree. And I think oh, it was $2.49. Oh my God, the glitter is crazy. But yeah, he is so cute. I also picked up these... Um, Let me get them. These, um, oh my god. What are you going on? Why? I'm just having like a brain fart right now. Um, candy canes. <laughs> candy cane sticks. I picked up four and two of these. And my idea is what I'm actually gonna do. I think once I finish filming, guys, I'm gonna go and do some DIYs because I have a little pile that I have to do DIYs to and I haven't gotten around to do it. But my idea is I'm going to distress these to make them look vintage and I want to add them like in a little picture or a little like cup or something. I did post this on my Instagram and a lot of ladies hit me up and was like, please, can you do like a, a, a reel or a video so we could see how you do it? So I might just do that. Um, And also, guys, I don't know if you know, I don't know what method you use to like distress things. But I have like two different, or maybe I use a couple of me different methods. But one of them is this, the Distress Ink. And this is, it says, it's called Vintage Photos. And you use this like for photos, papers, anything that you want to make look vintage. And I use this, let me open it. I use, that's how I look. I use this to like distress things to give that like old looking feeling to it. So I'm going to use it on and these. I'm not sure if I'm just going to like rub it on it or just like add little pieces. But yeah, guys, if you don't follow me, go check that out because I will be posting that. It's Jackie.m.04. So yeah, go check that out. Stay tuned for that. <laughs> All right, let's see. I'm just throw as much things in these bags because so it can make it easier for me. All right, so this was in the bag as well. This is from Joanne's. Um, yeah, and, and it was it says twenty ninety nine, but I want to say they were fifty percent off. But I just love it. I love the color of it. And I also picked up the mug, the matching mug. It's in another bag. You will be seeing that. Um, but yeah, it's so pretty. So I got that. All right, I also have another um candle for Marshall seven ninety nine, and it's the little Christmas trees on top, and it says winter white. And it smells pretty good. I love this brand as well. For Marshalls or like TJ Maxx or like Home Goods, they all carry like the same brand. And it's pretty good. It smells good. So I picked up another candle. This is from um Walmart as well. Um, but yeah, this one was $15.99, and I just love how he looks. Like it looks like it has glitter, but it's not. Like, I don't know if the camera catches it. Um but I don't know, like it's so, like frosted. It's like frosted. 
but it's so pretty. So I got him. This other um gingerbread tree was $16.99 and it was from Home Goods. And this is another of the gingerbread theme that is I going did on. find this rocking horse. Well, it's not a rocking horse, but this wooden horse on at where's um home goods i don't see the tag this was a while ago i did post this a while ago and i was so happy i found them actually i found one last year on clearance and i was so excited because i had wanted one and my husband bought me one at i think home depot or at loans it was like 50 dollars, but it was more of a neutral color um so when i seen this i was like oh i could pick it up but it's kind of like, I don't know, it wasn't like this, but you see how it's like cracking right here. And for some reason, like this wooden, anything wooden, it's just like, it starts like cracking. I don't know. But yeah, pick this. So up. this mug is from Claire's. It's the cutest thing. And it was $14.99, but I had a coupon for Claire's. So I picked it up and my daughter was like, can I have it? I'm like, of course. Um. So yeah, my daughter's cute reindeer mug i have homeless it's not christmas but i did pick it up it was this frame it was 9.99 and it gave me like a vintage feel to it so i picked it up so here is the santa i was like the vintage santa i was talking about it's hand painted in germany and it's, it's a santa claus limited edition and it was 60 dollars. the big one was i think 75 or 80 i can't even remember but yeah this is how we look and i know it's a little pricey but this is something i could use for years to come my kids could like i could pass it on i am i know a lot of people is gonna come for me and gonna say don't do it don't mess it up but i kind of want to distress it and give it a vintage look to it but I don't know. I might just leave it as is just because it's so pricey and it's supposed to, like, a, like it's a limited edition. It has the number. But yeah, this is the um, Santa. They had different colors, um, but I went more with that one because it had, like, the neutrals. The other one had, like, red and, like, other colors to it. Okay, so. All right, more bags, guys. I'm, like, full of bags. These were $6.99, and I have found this at when they first started putting Christmas items, and I got the um the tree. They had the gingerbread, and I was like, well, I kind of like the tree. They have, um like, the gingerbread little pot, like, baking stuff, and then they had the measuring cups. So I was like, I want the measuring cups, but I don't want to have, like, too matchy of everything. So I'm like, okay, so if they brought the gingerbread men um are on the designs maybe they will have like the gingerbread measuring cups but they didn't but i did pick up these and i i, I like these better than like the gingerbread men just because a friend of mine on instagram she we did a tray and she is sending me the gingerbread um measuring cups so it all worked out <laughs> so i got that i also got this tree which was $7.99 and it's battery. Well, it doesn't have battery. Um, operated, but I really, they had a, like a couple of them, but I only picked up one. Now I feel like I should have picked up two, but I got this like, like I said, way back when they first was putting Christmas decor with Halloween. So I was shopping for both. I also got this little cute Santa soap pump. And as you know, by now, I usually take this out, put a little cork, and call it a day, and add it to my decor. And he looks so cute. Because I really like these. To put soap, I feel like they go bad. Like, they start messing up. And as you can see, it doesn't even close correctly. And I noticed a lot of them was like that. But I was like, it doesn't matter because I'm taking it out. But I, I, get, I feel like the more you use it, it starts turning green. Just so I don't like using these as soap, um, hand soap. I also picked up this little, um, I, I call everything little. <laughs> I picked up this snowman. It's from Magnolia Homes. It was $12.99. And I thought it was so cute. They have a lot of stuff. But I'm like, okay, I'm not going crazy buying everything. Just because it looks nice. So I figured I could add him like, to my kitchen. So 
So I'm gonna grab that. I also picked up this Santa. He was $6.99. And I just love his face. It's so cute. So that's why I end up getting him. So, all right, let me just add this. Also, I was like, it's time for me to start filming all this because I need to start decorating. And by having everything in a bag and then take everything out just to film it, I'm like, no, no, no. We cannot do that. So, yeah, guys, stay tuned. There's going to be a couple of videos. Um, home goods. I also found these at the beginning. And I thought these would look so good as bow fillers. Oh, and they also look like vintage and i was so excited to find them so i might add these on on the bone that i have showed you or maybe like a different bone i did which i'm gonna i'm gonna show you i found this at target it's from the studio mcgee collection it's originally 35 dollars but it was on sale they had a bunch of stuff on sale like 60 percent off and i'm guessing that's to add two candles to it so i was thinking to add these inside let me know down below if you think that's a good idea with some like greenery that's my vision but i never go with <laughs> with what i envision sometimes i do sometimes i just go with the flow so yes i got this it's a it's a set of 24 mini ornaments so i got that i also oh this one's like squashed in this bag I also picked up these and once again these are what is this oh it's a it's a garland and you know what's crazy when I picked them up I thought they were ornaments <laughs> and it turns out to be a garland which is so pretty once again and that like vintage look to them I just like love them I don't know if I should use it as a garland or that bow filler a bow filler so yeah, let me know down below, guys. If I what should I do? Um, okay, so um, I also picked up this blanket, which is so beautiful, and it's the colors I'm going for. What the green and the neutral with a little bit of red. You know, we gotta add a little bit of red because Christmas is about green and reds. Now it's just neutral colors for us neutral people that just love <laughs> the neutral simple colors. But yeah, this one was $24.99 and it's so pretty. So I got that. I also picked up this one because I had bought of one, which I showed on my Instagram. Sorry if I sound like a broken record. I showed on my Instagram. I showed on my Instagram. But I did. <laughs> like I show a lot there. And I ended up returning it just because the material, it, was, it looks like it was going to literally turn to crap once you put it in the washing machine. But this one was $24.99 as well. And look how pretty it looks. Like, I don't know if you can see it. It has, like, the gold, a little gold into them. I haven't found the pillow. I did see it online. But, like I said, I'm kind of hesitating for the shipping. The shipping be killing me. And I was like, do I really need the pillow to wear? Because I have one, two, one, three, four, four pillows that I have bought so far. So I'm like, I might not need it. Let me just hold on to, to the idea just for a little bit longer. Um, Once I start decorating, if I feel like I should get the pillow and if it's still online, I will pick it. I will end up buying it. Here's another bag. Oh, which is pretty heavy. Oh. Okay. I picked up these bottle trees. Neutral bottle trees. This one was $9.99. This one was $7.99. And um, I have literally a box full of bottle trees from last year. From, you know, from Target when they were like a dollar to five dollars. I did have from last year. But they are, I think they like the neutral, the green ones too. Like green colors. But I thought this would look nice together. So I grabbed them. Ooh. I also picked this up a while back. It was $7.99. And I thought it would look cute at like bottle trees inside. Or um, I have little, what are they called? Oh my God. Acorn. 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 <laughs> um, little acorn inside. So I'm not sure yet what I'm going to do with that. Oh, I also found the little salt and pepper shakers from the sand salt. But I thought... Well, I'm not going to use it as salt and pepper, but as a little decor piece to add. And I thought it was cute. So it was $4.99. $4 Guys, I'm trying to go so fast here. 
Um, this one was from Joann's. It was $9.99, but I, once again, 50% off. And I just love how the ombre look is going on here. So I got that. You see, oh, look, look how pretty it looks all together. Like, add different, like, colors to them. Very pretty. Um, all right. So, oh, this is a mug that I was, it's from Joann's. It was $9.99, 50% off. And it's the one that matches the hand towel. Look how pretty. Look at the details to this. This is so pretty. So I got that. All right. Um, the next item. Oh, is this mug from Big Lots. It was $5.99. And they also had the salt and pepper shaker. But I didn't end up getting them. And now I wish that I did. But maybe I'll find them again in the store. But yeah, this is how Santa looks. Right. I'm telling you guys, I bought more bugs this, <laughs> this Christmas. And I always say no. And I do. I also picked up this one. But it's so pretty. Like how? How can you resist mugs um oh the little oh this is the little string um ribbon that was in that mud pie um mug but yeah but look at the details to it this is so pretty like i enjoy having a cup of coffee in the morning with the prettiest mugs <laughs> All right, this one I picked up as well, just because once again, it gives me that anthropology vibe to so it. They did come out with a line like this. I forgot when, what year was it, but I do have it. And my envision for my cabinet this year is I'm I'm trying to go for the, whole, just add anthropology um, Christmas decor, um, like pottery, items and even though this is not um anthropology i'm gonna add it just because it's it literally looks the same guys so that's another month all right oh all right michael's i picked up there's a reindeer he it was 24.99 but they were 40 percent on and um a friend of mine on instagram was the one who told me about it because i had posted um that i had found like the gingerbread cookies that's when michael's first started putting out like the christmas decor and she was like did you see the reindeer i did buy the the, the trees where is it right here the tree i thought i bought this tree and she was like did you see the reindeer i was like no i don't think i've seen it so she sent me a picture and i was like oh my god i must have him i went the next day and i found them and um she said she's trying to find like a gold vintage frame to put him in which is a good idea i think i might put him with a wreath I'm not sure how i'm gonna do it yet but most likely i'm leaning towards adding a wreath Right. and then once i got this little um bottle tree don't mind my dog sorry he's in a room barking at people out the window and these are the gingerbread cookies that i was um talking about and that i literally had so much dms about them where's the link do you have the link <laughs> and once again i don't have a problem sharing where i get anything so these are the gingerbread i got two packs because i think they will look cute like in a little bowl or on a little play just for like anesthetics vibes you know reasons that's it <laughs> but i thought it was be so pretty all right what else i also got this little um wooden sign it was 4.99 and i thought it was pretty so i picked it and i think that was all for my goose and now this little snow globe is a from um home goods i don't know you can see like the reflection of my ring light but look how pretty the snowman i mean the christmas sheets are um it doesn't have battery i put batteries to make sure that it works but then i had to take them out um but yes it let it i'm gonna see look how pretty it looks i just like love it so um what did you say oh so these one two three four one two three four four items are from a little shop on instagram i think it's <sighs> cottage and cotton cotton and cottage i can't remember i know i i mentioned them before on my page but 
I will try to link everything as well. But I picked up this little Sansa from the company, from the website. I also picked up another mug, but this one has a Christmas tree. It's very pretty. So I got that. I also got this platter and it has all the reindeers. Look how cute is that? Let me see, can you see? Look how cute is that? I can't remember the prices because they, they didn't come with prices, but if I find them and I link them, um you could check it out there i also picked up this little vintage santa i thought it would be bigger because i have seen bigger ones but i just like add it to the cart add it to the cart that's what i was on and then i i added so much stuff and then i was like whoa 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 let me step back for a minute remove 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 because i went a little too crazy and i was like let me just keep it to four items <laughs> but yeah this is how he looks. all right so Pottery Barn. So, I have been wanting this Pottery Barn mug since last year. And for some reason, I, I was like, well, I don't need it. Just because I have the Big Lock one. <laughs> and I was like, well, I don't need the Pottery Barn one if I have the Big Lock ones. But if you really look at them, they're, they, you would think they're similar. I mean, they're the same. They're not the same. They kind of look similar. If you really look at their eyes... It's a little different. This one's a little tanner. I mean, it is what it is. This one was from Big Life. I think it was like $5. This one was um, $15. And online, it doesn't let you buy one. You have to buy all four, which I freaking hate. So I checked for the closest one, and they had one, um, I want to say, an hour from me. And my boy, my boyfriend, oh, my God. My son's girlfriend um, lives in the town where they had the part of Yvonne's. So she did me a big favor and picked it up for me. Thank you, Anna. <laughs> I know you're watching. And she also gifted me this little ornament that I put in this tree. Oh, my God. It's like the cutest thing ever. And it's just like, it's neutral. And I added a picture, guys. It says 2022, which I love because, you know, we got married this year. Let me see. And I added this. Even though the picture didn't kind of fit. Um, but I left it white. I mean, I'm going to try to see what can I do to, like, bring down. Because it's the way the picture is. But anyway, this is the picture frame. And it's so pretty. And now, like, I really didn't collect little ornaments only the starbucks ones like the little ones those are the only ones i used to collect and now i feel like i need one and i also made this one for my dog last year because it was his first christmas with us with my cricket machine i got this um wooden I actually still got the price it was like 8.99 this little ornament and i just put 2021 and his name and now i feel like i need literally this tree keep this tree well i have this one's from target from last year um, but I have another bigger one that I have bought at uh, Home Goods and Clarence last so you, Christmas ago, and I think I'm gonna use it just to add little memorable ornaments. Like Anna, you see what you just started? Like now, I feel like I have to collect little ornaments. So I have one for my puppy, me and my husband. Now I need to get one for my daughter and my three boys. <laughs> this literally was the first purchase. What I didn't make my husband made because I had seen it and I was like, oh my God, I need them. But I didn't buy him. And then I kept thinking about it. So I sent my husband, like I think two days later or the next day to pick him up, which is this guy right here. Look how gorgeous. Look how gorgeous he is. Oh my God. I'm just like obsessed. I collect these. Well, it's the brand, um, Eric, and I always forget the la the other name. And I should know because if I collect that, I should know their name, right? But no, my mind doesn't work like that. But anyway, I have the two, which you have seen in my homes, all my decorate with me. It's the rabbit and um, the deer holding like a little dish. And then around the summertime i found this same guy but like the smaller version and i don't i don't think i ever posted it here but i did have a i did post a picture on instagram oh, i got this hello at home goods 
and i like it because once again guys the neutral trees uh, i just love and it has like the green that i said i was gonna use this year and this is how it looks so i picked up this guy i also found this one but this one's going in my room look how pretty actually does it match the pill the blanket i just picked up i didn't even know this but I think, if I'm not mistaken, it it goes with the with the other blanket. But anyway, yeah, I picked this one up. A twenty four ninety nine. Look how pretty. I also got this candle from Walmart. It smells so good, so I end up getting it. It says vanilla bean and pumpkin, and it smells amazing. But you know how sometimes a candle smells amazing, and once you lit it, light, not lit it, once you light it, it doesn't smell the same. So let's see how that turns out. <laughs> All right. I also got this um Santa from um Home Goods. And I got them because I'm gonna actually paint them. I had a tall one from like two years ago, and I ended up painting him last year, like a um, beige color to go more for like theme I'm going for. So that's why I picked up this guy. I'm I'm not sure like if i'm gonna paint them or not i'm gonna try to see if i could incorporate him if he doesn't go bright i will be painting him let's see and i got this where did i get this candle i want to say home goods i want to say but yeah it's a, it's an ornament candle and i don't have I even forgot about these guys. I don't even know why I picked this up. Just because I have two small green ones that I bought at Joanne's last year on sale. And it's a candle as well. Like this stuff I have had for a while. So that's why I'm like, oh, okay. Alright, I also picked up this frame. $5.99 and it has Christmas tree. last thing in this bag is this reindeer. I don't know what like at the time you know when you buy stuff and you're like oh i know where i'm gonna place and what i'm gonna do he was 7.99 i think i'm gonna use like the rough and buff on him just because it's so gold and i i'm not i don't know i want it i'm gonna yeah i'm gonna definitely use the rough and buff and add maybe like little ornaments yes that's what i'm gonna swim so that's how it looks guys so the next time you see this guy he's gonna be go <laughs> this tree tree measuring cups guys look how freaking adorable this is i end up finding two i end up trading the other one for the gingerbread measuring cups so um yeah this is how it looks so pretty that's all for home goods march shoes but i always have some other random stuff somewhere in the house so <laughs> i guess i would show it in my home decorate with me um so we're gonna go we're gonna talk about these bad boys behind me because i think i want to end the film i want to end the film i want to end the video so i could start part two just because there's so much to accumulate in one video guys but we're gonna go through it so let me see if you could see if you see these guys i'm gonna try to move out the way just because, huh? oh my god you heard that okay let's see um don't mind the other items i just threw stuff there <laughs> but this is how they look um let me just move and this lady on instagram had posted about them I guess she posted in her stories, but I really don't be paying attention to people's stories. Like, I will click, listen a little bit, and then I get off. Because it's just like, I don't know. I, I'm, I'm too busy sometimes. But I should be paying attention more. But I end up seeing her picture. And they looked so beautiful the way. It was totally different. When I found it, I wasn't even looking for them. I went to CS to pick up a prescription for my husband, his inhaler. I was walking around trying to kill time and I seen them and I was like, oh shit, those are the ones that lady posted. But then when I got home that I actually looked at her pictures, it's totally different. Like the hat is different and 
his um like jacket which i kind of like the other one better but what i'm gonna do with these because as you can see it looks he has like glitter and silver and that's not what i'm going for i'm going more for like the vintage look i'm gonna remove the black and i'm gonna paint it the color of his jacket and then i'm gonna silver i'm gonna use um the vintage photo ink and i'm gonna place it all on the where the silver is these were seven nine i mean seven and i i wish they were eighty dollars and i got 20 percent off of one and 40 percent off actually this one because at the bottom it's like crack just a little bit but they noticed when i phoned it up and i noticed as well so the manager came up and was like all right we'll give it to you for 40 and the other one for 20 so it worked out great it came out to 120 for both which is way better than what 160 dollars plus tax for each so i'm thinking i'm just putting them both by right here in my fireplace or in front of my tv i still don't know but yeah i'm definitely gonna try to take all this silver out guys